Okay, welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy, you beautiful bastards. Uh, what did we do in the last one? I took a little bit of a break. I forgot. Something. Side missions. We unlock those, doing spells, what's it, who's it. Uh, also, I looked it up for my own safety. My own sanity. And we need to go to the clock tower courtyard for uh, the last d d d d d dandelion key. Oh. Some uh, pumpkins. Indestructible pumpkins. Aloha, Mora. And also, there is, um, Lumos. Frickin' uh, a Hogwarts secret. It's to do with that clock. That we can do also. It's really nice pumpkins. Good pumpkin carving. But I would imagine that people don't actually carve pumpkins now. They can just get something else to do it. Thank you. Uh, oh, god damn it. My freaking battery's low on my controller. Let's hope that doesn't poop out during a uh, combat. Because if it does, <laughs> kind of screwed. Yeah, here's where we have to do it. Revelio. There, up it goes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So many goddamn stairs. The last one, the last one of the season. <coughs> oh, sorry, I was premature. <coughs> there we go. We did it. Hmm. Revelio. This is another way down, a way up. Oh. Oh. oh, look at that! Nice outside. Oh. Revelio. And then, does this connect to the freaking? Yeah. Yeah, it's all connected. It all is connected. That's great to know. <laughs> now I gotta freaking do all of this. <laughs> What's the symbol for this? Uh, it's a bat. <laughs> oh. Oh. 
Friggin' I'm pressing the wrong buttons. I've played this game for friggin' hours and I'm pressing the wrong button. Arrest the <laughs> and a legendary chest for me. Okay. 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 So, is there other things connected to the other freaking? Uh, oh, well, that would answer it. Yes. This one. It's that one. Arrest them, arrest them. Oh. God damn it. Okay, I just went through that. So, so there's at least another door. We we got that door. And then there's the door on the bottom floor. So it has to be like the fourth one, correct? Okay, here it is. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, well, I think we're too late on that one. Let me do it, let me do it, let me do it, let me do it. Oh. Oh, this is awkward. Yeah, I'll just go behind you. Can't see me, right? Okay. And we just need this one. Arrest the heh, heh, heh. Why is it so long? Ah, uh, fa. Fa. Can I do it from down here? Oh. Oh, that might be too soon. Arrest the heh, heh. Oh. Bada bing, bada boom. Another one? Solved. I think that just leaves what, uh, what the headmaster one. Oh, good. I'm not. It's a hybrid, bouncing tentacular. Please, no. I've finished the activities you assigned me, Professor Garlic. Wonderful. Took me a whole season. I hope you gained a greater appreciation for the flora in our lives. I am forever enraptured by it. Just yesterday, I spent hours pruning my self-fertilizing shrubs and flutterby bushes. Didn't realize how long I'd been at it until the sun began to set. Well, if there's one thing I love to see more than my plants thriving, it's one of my students doing the same. Now, ready to learn flippendo? No. Chin up, keep a light grip, and it's all in the wrist. Let's see you give it a go. You will want to focus with this spell. Nothing is mortifying as knocking back a colleague when all you wanted to do was move a few parts. Wonderfully done. If you'd like to practice a bit more, you're welcome to do so here in the greenhouse. Just mind the plants, please. Uh... Professor, I was wondering where you're from. What's your background? Oh, how nice of you to ask. Well, let's see. I grew up in London, right on the Thames. 
That sounds lovely. All mm -hmm. the sights and bustle of a city. To some, yes. I used to dream of living in the country, but it wasn't until I came to Hogwarts that I felt truly at home. Mind you, it did take some time, and whilst it is my fervent hope that each student eventually feels as at home here as I do, it is not always the case. I suppose that makes sense. Well, we each bloom differently, don't we? Some of us, like Devil's Snare, thrive in the shadows, whilst others crave the attention of a bouncing bulb. And we each grow and thrive according to our own plan. Oh, I was terribly nervous when I arrived at the castle. You see, as a child, I knew nothing of witches or wizards. You can imagine how astonished I was to receive my letter from Hogwarts. I spent a good deal of time alone in either the greenhouse or the library my first days here. I'm sorry the other students weren't more friendly. Oh, but I've given you the wrong impression. On the contrary, I was shown great kindness. In fact, a seventh year took me under her wing during those first days. She remains one of my dearest friends. How fortunate. I was indeed. I dare say you'll find that the friends you make here at Hogwarts will last a lifetime. Now, I'd best get to my recent delivery from the Magic Neep. Mr. Teasdale promised me quite an assortment of seeds this week. Lovely to see you. Mm. Mm. Okay. Next class. Apparently there's also a side mission. Oh. Oh yeah, guy. It's friggin' this guy. Friggin' he wants his stupid... ...statues that I can't do. There's also what uh, should be one up here for us to get. What do we have here? I hope those assignments were challenging enough for you. I've completed all of my tasks, Professor Onai. Very well done. Although I must admit, I did have something of a premonition that you would follow through. Now, as you have no doubt sharpened your perception by completing my assignment, I am curious, based upon the knowledge that one's present, and even one's past may reveal traces of what is to come. What do you see in your own future? Oh. Mm. I can't get rid of this feeling of a coming danger. I see. Know that such omens are not damning if they can at least prepare us. And you are preparing yourself even now. But this talk of tomorrow should not divert us from your present success. I shall inform our good deputy headmistress of your exemplary performance. And if that performance is any omen of what your future may hold, then I, for one, see great things. 
channel your magic towards your targets. Mm. Okay, okay. Wasn't ready, really. You have it. Now, why not practice the new spell on the training dummy? Long spell. Sorry. Excellent. I think you have it. <laughs> hmm. Definitely, I get to some combinations here. Professor, do you have a moment? I do. I was wondering how you decided to teach divination. Ah, divination. The art of divination is an important yet often misunderstood branch of magic. Those of us who possess the sight are rare. And, as is often the case with the unique among us, we can frequently be misread, even feared. When I was granted the opportunity to teach others about my gift and the good it can do, I was most grateful. I see. Natty told me that you and she moved here from Uganda, where she had attended Wagadu. Yes. Natsa Wagadu. and I both loved Uganda and Wagadu, but we are happily settled here now. I had foreseen such a change, but did not know the details until it occurred. I was glad of the outcome. You would be wise to remember that the consequences of our actions are complex. And so, divining what is to come is not as simple as gazing into a crystal ball or studying the bottom of a teacup. I find it truly intriguing, even if I don't fully understand it. <laughs> intriguing. That is one word for it. And I'm certain you will come to understand many things more deeply in the days ahead. You are a student at Hogwarts, after all. It cannot have escaped you that we in the Wizarding world are forever navigating the seemingly inexplicable. Of course, Professor. Now, I know that we both have places to be. Not because I have the sight, mind you, but because I am a professor and you are a student. I have enjoyed our conversation. Well, thank you. Now, if you don't mind, I'm just gonna wait till night here. Mind now, Demi guys. Excuse me. Sorry. Ooh, I had a nice nap. Okay, goodbye. Rebellion. Another nap up here, right? Yeah, but okay. What are you looking at? At some point, you must stop preparing and put your newly honed skills to the test outside of the classroom. Okay. Fine. Where's the common room for me to uh, do the unspeakable? Here we go. One, two, a three, a three. Here we go. The last house token. Time to see what's inside. Well, look at that. Thanks goes to the former headmistress, Eupraxia Mole. Let's check that out, huh? huh? Got a scarf, huh? Yeah, nice, that's nice. Wand hilt. Still looks painful to hold. And then we got some uh, frickin' cloak or whatever, you know. Oh, what? Jesus.
Well, that just seems a bit much. But also, it looks really cool. Way better than this. Oh. Well, now that's cool, too. They didn't change this properly, so. Uh, we'll save this for like winter or something. It's got the nice fur. Uh, yeah. Hmm. Go back to this. How much uh, gear do I have before I do this story mission? Well, looking at the time, maybe it's not good to do the story mission. So never mind. Side mission? Oh, oh no, not again. Oh god, oh, jeez, jeez, man. You need to do that. Jesus. Some violent freaking people. I can unlock this Hello, now. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. I'll take that. A loose black and white pinstripe scarf. Okay. And 41 Gaurians. But I believe uh, the last... Uh, Secret of Hogwarts is the freaking uh, headmaster's office. Revelio. Might, yeah, it might be up above there. I am not sure how to get in this one. I don't remember. Uh, 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 can't get in. Bummer. Mm. Well, bam. I don't know what it was. <laughs> oh. 
another room. Luckily, I uh, was looked. To be, uh, yeah. <laughs> Luckily, I saw this from up there. Okay, where? Uh, Professor Hackett, as discussed, I have corresponded with my goblin acquaintances at Green Gods. All have uh, condemned Ron Rock's actions, and some have privately considered that his motives may not be what they seem. From what I've heard of his treatment towards others, of his keen kind, are those who refuse to join his ranks, I'm inclined to agree with our friends at the bank. What? From what I've heard of his treatment towards others of his kind, of his own kind, those who refuse to join his ranks, I'm inclined to agree with our friends at the bank. Oh, okay. Motives and... Okay, okay, I'm sorry. I will let you know what, what more I hear. Suffice it to say that, for now, we must remain vigilant. Respectfully... Uh, uh, so... A soap sharp. Well. Revelio. Another lock. Oh, that's a that's a hefty lock. Can't do that. Hmm. Too late for a story mission. Well, how about we just do all of these freaking Merlin trials that are nearby this one place? It's like a place right out of a storybook. Let me just check my gear. Then we can sell it. Like a zealot we are. Oh, pleasure to see Mr. Radley, do you have a moment? For you? Always. You're a hero around here. Hmm. Any interesting chatter going around the town? The absconder's finally gone, so that's a relief. <laughs> but enough of spiders, eh? Everything is peaceful now. Or as peaceful as one could expect, given the current state of the world. Did you know Mary Portman, the spider brooder? Not personally, although everyone here speaks very fondly of her. Her friends say that she had a soft spot for the arachnids, but no one expected anything like this. Uh, you know what they say about good intentions, though. Thanks to her little hobby, quite a few lives were lost. Well, I'd like to know more about you, Mr. Adley. Eh, not much to tell. I'm a merchant, but I also make it my personal business to provide every customer with what they need. Oh. What do you have for sale? A anything I can help you find? Oh, with what I need. And you're saying that I need these goddamn trash items? I'm insulted. I take offense to that. Now. Nope. Oh. What are these? Hmm. Oh, 
Oh, Hawk Pump. Okay, no. Uh, there we are. I should investigate. Do, 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 do. What we got here? What useless, utter trash that I'm gonna sell instantly. Rebellion. Oh, what the hell is that? What do I do about that? Huh? Uh. Nope. Huh? Oh, oh. What? Oh, it just brought me out, and I totally missed it. Okay. Now I know that is a thing. That's good to know. Revelio. And I said, like, oh, if we're gonna... I'm gonna do these Merlin Trials. Totally didn't do the Merlin trials in the allotted time that I was supposed to. I know I'm not in trial when I see one. But I'll keep to my word. We'll do it. I just need to, or at least do one, because I'm not sure if I'll be able to solve all of this. Where, 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 where does this go, huh? Uh, how do I get down? Gonna make me take the long way? Ugh. 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 Excuse me, Mr. Spider. Hit a flaming spire and blow it up. God damn it, never mind. Never mind. Whoops. Hey, look, another one down there. It might be that one. And all these Merlin trials are built on top of each other. On top of each other.
You can feed a beast. Atreficus Totalus. It's shameful what you've done to helpless beasts. And I can Hello, free him. Oh, I'm going to be a saint now. And not, like, just kind of basically kill him. Because, you know, I would be able to free him, but couldn't unlock the lock. And then they would just be stuck there. And they would probably die. <laughs> Do that. Lumos. Not like I couldn't just freaking break of the bars or something around it. No, the lock was impeding my progress. That's that. Settled. Oh, here's a pleasant surprise. Making that noise again, man. I swear to God. Stop it. Also. I'm not sure if, like, if I get rid of Accio. Because I was thinking of replacing it with, um, just Leviosa and stuff. Wingardium Leviosa. And it would accomplish the same thing. But maybe not. That... Pulls it towards you, Leviosa freaking just levitates it. So, um, oh, <laughs> oh, twenty seven. So strong. Another point for me to use. Huh, what, what uh, talent should I get now? Anything I like there. And I should really probably rebalance my uh, spells Rebellion. for like a better combo the potential. But I still have so many spells left to learn. Especially the big ones. <laughs> oh, we got the balls. Hence why I saw the ball Rebellion. down there. <sighs> I mean, these are going to take me forever to find. So, yeah. And then we got the freaking butterflies over there. Great. I love... Oh, hey, here's some balls. <laughs> Like, there was balls down there, right? Or am I crazy? Or did I use the wrong balls? 
And the ball should have gone to this one. You know, a closer one. Wait, no, there's I see balls over there. Okay, 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 good, good, good. Did this freaking correctly? Last one is up here. So the ball's gotta be somewhere. Revelio. Oh, right there. Okay. What? Is that just another hedge? Okay. Freaking scared me for a second. Okay. Am I supposed to see a dragon yet? Where do the butterflies lead? Oh, there we go. Going over there, okay. Stairs Ooh. and Moonstone. <laughs> and we'll do this one and then call it there. I wonder if they will add Quidditch or something as a DLC. Or save it for the sequel. I know what that means. Merlin trial. Okay. Ah. Now I know this. Uh. Come with me. Uh. Eh. What is this? Freaking kite flying? Was kite flying here before? Oh. Look at that. <laughs> oh, but of course, it's not like actual kite flying. It's freaking what? It's freaking spell kite flying? Jesus. 
What is this world coming to you? You can't just fly a kite. You have to do this freaking spell to fly a kite. <sighs> oh, oh. Anywho, with that being said, I'll leave it here for this one. We didn't do that other one, but we'll do it next time or something. It's not going anywhere. Unlike me. So, I hope you enjoyed uh, this episode, you beautiful bastards. And I will see you when I see you. <laughs> Bye-bye.